Welcome to Starbase Pink. This is your daily space and SpaceX news. Let's start the updates with Stock Space. We already know that the second stage short hop flight is planned this year, but when? We don't know yet, but we have this new picture shared today by Stock Space. This is the second stage heading to the test site. In the other side, another rocket is ready for liftoff. We are talking here about Relativity Space's Tiran 1 rocket. After securing the FAA launch license, they are now targeting March 8th between 1 pm and 4 pm to launch Tiran 1 rocket from Launch Complex 16 at Cape Canaveral. Mission name GLHF means good luck, have fun. Starship B7 S24 is ready to go too. No more static fire tests for B7. SpaceX still needs an FAA launch license. In the meantime, they have time to put the last upgrades on the orbital launch mount and the ground support equipment. And also testing other ships, like what we saw at Starbase yesterday, captured from La Padre's Nerder camera. The first cryo test for Ship 26, for both oxygen and methane tanks. Here we can see SpaceX drone coming from the build site to the launch site for live inspection and to get some nice aerial footage too. I think Ship 26 will be used as an orbital tank depot to test the docking systems. Closure cancelled for today and tomorrow. We have possible closure for Friday, February 24th from 8 am to 4 pm. ULA CEO Tori Bruno talking about Vulcan rocket testing. He said it's a large amount of testing, currently exercising every electrical and mechanical system on the rocket that can be done dry while doing the same at the pad that can be done without the rocket. Then we will roll to the pad and do it all again. That's it for now. This is the end of this episode. See you tomorrow.